your community and your sports environment. Thank you very much for the bottom of my heart. of my co-owners and uh, the team and coaching staff are proud to share this moment with you because I would have, uh, I'd be lying if I told you that six years ago I would have envisioned 100,000 people on Market Street and helicopters flying overhead. And the great thing about the soul is a uh, parallel with the great city of Philadelphia, which of course is the third place of our nation. This is the little train that could. This is the sports team that said, we are going to be your sports team. We are going to be the team that you feel a part of the most. And uh, we want to thank you for the opportunity for letting us be a part of your lives as much as you become a part of our lives. So let us celebrate the moment as the 2008 and we the world champions, and thank you for this honor. Big fan, and you know, anybody who knows Mayor Michael Nutter knows it. Nobody's hurting not to be here more than him right now. I gotta say that even before the final score was on the board on Sunday, he had already reached out to all of his staff and said, plan a parade. And of course, we're like, well, what happens if not, not plan the parade? We had the direction from him. He's the biggest fan, and so on behalf of him, I'd like to thank the soul once again, and again apologize that he couldn't be here. Any Bon Jovi fans out here will understand what I'm about to say. That for years, we were living on a prayer. And for years, people kept telling us to keep the faith. And we all know that we wanted a championship, dead or alive. And so on Sunday, July 27th, we went out with a blaze of glory and brought home a championship to Philadelphia. So thank you so. <laughs> And at this time, on behalf of Mayor Michael Nutter and the city of Philadelphia, I'd like to present this proclamation to the ownership and to the team, the Philadelphia Soul. It reads, on Sunday, July 27th, the Philadelphia Soul captured Arena Football's most coveted honor, the Jim Foster Trophy. With a stunning 59-56 win over the San Jose Sabercats, the Philadelphia Soul's five-year quest for a championship was realized, and the drought in Philadelphia is finally over. The Soul has been an enormous source of pride for fans throughout Philadelphia and the entire Delaware Valley. Under the effective leadership of co-majority owners and co-chairman of the board, John Bon Jovi and Craig A. Spencer, members of the ownership group, Richie Sambora, Leo Carlin Jr., and Ron Jaworski, who also serves as president, general manager, Rich List, happy birthday, and head coach Brett Munsey, the Philadelphia Soul are now firmly established as a dominant force in the AFL and one of the league's premier teams. 
Their sterling performance this season and incomparable team spirit have brought honor, glory, and national acclaim to the great city of Philadelphia. We are a city of champions, and we urge all citizens to join in a rousing cheer. Therefore, on behalf of Honorable Michael A. Nutter, Mayor of the City of Philadelphia, do we hereby officially proclaim Thursday, July 31st, as Philadelphia Soul Day of Champions in the City of Philadelphia, and urge every citizen to show their support by cheering on the team that has at long last brought a world championship back to Philadelphia. Thank you, sir. today when we turn that corner on Market Street and I thank you. I thank you for all the support. For me, this trophy right here represents the best ownership giving back to the greatest sports fans in America. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Alas, we've got, we've got a new facility. We've got a new trophy case coming. I've asked the guy making it not to make that the centerpiece because we're going to have a new one next year. We're going to repeat, baby. Thank you. that has spoken right here has worked so hard is for the reason that's sitting on that table, that trophy. And the main reason that that has come to Philadelphia is because of all the people out here and the support that we've got. Can't thank you enough the support that we've got with the best fans in America. Thank you so much. And I'll tell you what, man. This guy is as big a target as there can be, as there will be ever. Please welcome your 2008 Arena Football League Offensive Player of the Year, number 81, Chris Jackson! I'll tell you what, this is uh, this is straight up overwhelming for every last one of us up here to do our job of arena football and to practice and to play games as entertainment for our work and to get rewarded like this after bringing home a championship is what it's all about. As fans play a big part, you know, without you guys supporting us going to games, we are the to Philly, man. Um, we couldn't do this without you guys. You guys make our job easy to come out and play for fans like you guys. We work hard, just like you guys do. Blue Collar City, the Blue Collar Team. We love you, Philly. Thank you very much. And uh, I guess the only way to do it is to boom it on three. We're going to have whole Philadelphia do it, whole Market Street. Join us on this one. Do my three. One. 